we have already talked about the naming convention for variables in python in today's video we are going to talk about variable names having multiple words in it so let's say i want to create a variable that has multiple words in it for example i want to create a variable named as something like school name all right so these two words are two different words but if i want to make a variable out of it we know already that we can't add any spaces between different words or you can say we can't keep any space in variables name so we can't use this as a variable name so we can do this school name we can do this school name or you can use this as the variable name. Now, I know that obviously you can use this as well, but that's not the point. I am simply showing you how you can eliminate this space between them because in variable, we can't keep any space. All right. But there are some conventions as well. So whenever we want to add multiple words in a single variable, we can think of some uh, predefined convention some naming convention and we call them case for example there are a lot of case like camel case snake case pascal case and so on but based on the programming language there are some fixed techniques that we normally use to make our variables more readable to the users and to the programmers as well all right so firstly we are going to talk about something like pascal case so pascal case let me simply comment all of these and let's start like this pascal case so what is pascal case in pascal case each word in a variable always starts with a capital letter so let's say i'm going to create a variable named my school name for example all right for example in the three cases i'm going to show you today we are going to see what we can do with this my school name so if i want to write my school name using pascal case so what i have already told you that in pascal case every words first letter is an uppercase letter so my school name this contains the different words right so if i want to make an individual variable out of it so i can use this the first word of this word uh, i mean the first letter of this word will be capital and the first word is of this word will also be capital so my school name like this, something blah 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 for example if i would all right so you see that the first letter of every word is capital here so this is pascal case and then we have camel case camel case in camel case each word except the first it starts with a capital letter now let me write that down here for you as well so each word except the first word always starts with a capital letter so for example if i want to write my school name in camel case this would be something like this the first word the first word would be i mean the first letter of the first word would be a small or you can say the first word would always be in the lowercase so this would be my and then the rest of the words first letter would be in uppercase only all right so the second word was school so like this is school and name let's say back so this is camel case and then we have another case and we call that the snake case this is interesting because this kind of looks like a snake so here in snake case each word is separated by an underscore character each word is sorry separated by an underscore character so i can write it like this my school name equal to aub or i can also write like this my school name equal to weird something like this so you get the point right so we normally use three case in declaring variable names those are 
the pascal case camel case and snake case you can use any case you want but we normally use the pascal case and camel case more often but throughout the entire video i might use pascal case i might use camel case or i might use snake case or i might use any different case don't worry you can choose whatever you like but if you get any case to your liking then i would recommend you to stick with that all right so this is it for today see you tomorrow